and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate video, guys. And today, we finally have the insane Mark Crash set. Well, honestly, I think we've all been waiting for it for at least a month or two. We've all been saying for about at least a month or two that Mark was going to crash from a lot of things. It never really did. This was one we were waiting for. Sadly, it was Series 6, but I did, I did tell you guys, this was a given. This one was going to be a given. It just took a while, but this one was going to be a given because a lot of the higher players we've been waiting for, A, would now have power passes, so their value would tank. They'd be Redux cards, so their value would be tank. I kind of just all attributed to it, guys, but I'm super excited. I can finally start to pick up some of the cards that I've been waiting so long for. Now, the only thing is with some of these cards I've waited for that I might wait even a little bit longer is that there are golden tickets coming. And I know I'm going to want those golden tickets. So, in that case, I might want to wait. Like, as such, in the case of Lamar Jackson, I kind of want golden ticket RG3 or golden ticket Vic, one of those. So, I might want to wait and see those cards first or golden ticket Lamar. But those cards could be crazy expensive. So, I really just don't know the route I'm taking shit. But I'm going to check through all the prices to tell you guys what's kind of worth at this point for the average player. But, guys, before we get into the video, make sure to go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that on, good boys. Come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And yeah, let's head over to the auction block. Comment down below if you guys need any help with anything, as per usual. And go drop a follow over on Twitter. Now, let's head over to the auction block and start from the tippity top because I'm pretty excited to talk about some of this stuff near the top today. Guys, I've been waiting for all these cards. First off, the free agencies are definitely, the free agent cards are definitely a part of the market crash. This clowny is super, super cheap. Now, we compare him to um, Lawrence Taylor. Is he worth it? Now, he's only slightly faster than Lawrence Taylor. Less strength, same tackle. Way better play rec, way better block shit, way better power move. But here's the thing, for the most part, people mostly care about finesse because that will be the quicker rush move. So in terms of finesse, the Lawrence is far better. Now here's the thing in terms of the next Lawrence card. The next Lawrence card is coming soon. Maybe as short as next weekend. Now that Lawrence Taylor card will be faster than this Jadavion Clowney. He will have more excel, he'll have more strength, he'll have more tackle, slightly less play rec. He'll have same block shed, better power move, and way better finesse move. His finesse move probably will be like in the 96. Close to 99 with uh, chems, uh, chems in general. Like, that card's going to be insane. So you're going to have a more athletic, more convert, better version of J.A.V. Clowney. So in my, in my opinion, I will, I will be waiting for this Lawrence Taylor. Because this is the bait. That's what Clowney is. He's, he's a typical Madden bait that they want to drop on you like a week before. And then you fall for it. And then you end up getting screwed. Now, Joe Thune, pretty good left, looking left guard. I do need a left guard on my team. So he's looking like a good, good pickup. His run blocking isn't the same as his pass blocking is. Looking like a pretty solid pickup. And now for the price, guys, these are really cheap cards. I'd give it maybe like another week though as more free agency stuff comes out before you actually go on and buy those. But in terms of these, like Patrick Mahomes for 686, finally he's below a million coins and it happened in short order. Like, right, it just went real fast from the moment he the stuff started coming out. When I pick up Mahomes now, here's the thing. If you want the perfect passer, the perfect improviser style, can do it all guy, it's Patrick Mahomes. Now, who could be better than Mahomes? I want to say Steve Young, but I don't think Steve Young either because Steve Young, by when he comes out, will only be a 98. I think the only guy that can compete with um, a Patrick Mahomes will be the Golden Tickets. That's pretty much it. Golden Tickets are going to be the only things to compete with them, such as the Lamars, the RG3s, the Michael Vicks, Cam Newtons. So if you want to get a really cheap Golden Ticket, go with Patrick Mahomes because Golden Tickets are going to be the other 99s, and they're not, when they come out, they're going to be crazy expensive. So you can always go with Mahomes. And if you don't want to actually wish coins Mahomes and you want to try them out, test your power passing them. But I think he's a great value. Now, Night Train Lane, an awesome, awesome value. 692 gonna wait a little bit longer or I'll just end up using my, I might just end up using my power passing them quite honestly Looking it looks guys on my team. He's gonna have like 97 or 98 speed gonna have 99 zone close to 99 man close to 99 press gonna be good Good hit power good height good physicality gonna be an awesome car gonna be 99 on my team So he is the next move probably with my power pass and for my 99 pass You cannot use those pass on golden tickets So do not hold it for that as far as 99 pass You're gonna have to hold it just for now and because it's really only 199 in the game So I'll probably hold it just for the time being and just wait and see what ends up happening with more 99s coming out probably ultimate legends and maybe even the last for agency master potentially which could be like a brady which i still don't think we be better than Mahomes. now guys what i'm really excited about is lamar jackson lamar jackson finally out of the three million coin range just, like this price is unreal let's compare him to patrick Mahomes. see who would be the better buy at this point man so the speed blows him away now, let's start with the passing throw power the power of lamar and you come up and go deep and you have John Madden passing, you probably get his throw power up to like 96. Not the biggest difference, quite honestly. It is, but it isn't. Like, that's still pretty good. Short accuracy. Lamar actually will be tied. They're both going to hit 99s, my team. 
Medium accuracy, Patrick Mahomes got him by a fair margin. Now, we come down to deep accuracy. Again, Mahomes will have 99, Pat Lamar will have like a 95, 96. Throwing the pressure, they'll actually have identical. Unless, well, actually, when you if you power them both up, they'll have identical either way. Throwing the run, they'll both have 99s, and play action, Lamar beats them by a fair margin. Now, what matters here, in my opinion, it comes down to medium accuracy and deep accuracy versus speed that's as simple as it comes down to because at the end of the day that medium and that deep is going to be going to hit 99 and lamar's won't it'll be mid 90s but that speed the 10 difference in speed will make the difference as a pure runner athlete kind of guy guys in my opinion i haven't tried lamar so i can't speak on it too much but in my opinion mahomes in terms of it all if you have an all well-rounded offense like you pass you run you do everything Mahomes might be the better if you're if you're like a big passer and stuff. Mahomes might be the better option, but if you play like me, I'm very run oriented. Lamar could be your guy, but in terms of price right now, Mahomes is a great value. I'd recommend, in my opinion, trying them both out with your power passes first, and then moving on down, guys. There's really nothing else here besides that Delaney Walker. No one really cares about. Now, guys, the Ultimate Legend market has crashed significantly, as well as the Team of the Year. Now let's go over to the Ultimate Legend first. because I'm really excited to go look at those guys. They came down quite a bunch. I can never find. They're all the way up here, right? Guys, I was gone for a week. Don't kill me. Okay, so as we come on down, 172k for an ultimate legend, Brian Herlocker. You know how cheap that is? You can power this guy up to 97 and come up to probably like a 98. 98 overall card for 172k. Great, great value. And now some of the better ones like Peppers are low 200. Palomalu low 200. Kurt Warner's ass, I don't even worry about him. Calvin Johnson's low. Marcus Allen. Rod Woodson, who was one of the more solid ones. Brian Dawkins, super cheap. Now, in my opinion, who would I want out of the cheaper ones? Like, again, Ray Lewis, I'm kind of waiting on because I think I'd rather just get that new Devin White and get that crazy speed that I'm going to get with him. And then Julius Peppers is obviously great. Eric Dickerson for 290 is a solid, solid deal, which th does lead me over to go check some. Now, as far as Ultimate Legends go, guys, today's Saturday, Ultimate Legends Saturday. Once the cards do drop, make sure you're checking out these Ultimate Legends because they will be even cheaper. So, today's a great day to buy Ultimate Legends. I highly recommend you snipe some out. Resell them back later for a profit. Now, coming on to the free agency promo because I'm very interested to see the free agency type not the free agency promo the theme builders too right here because these cards should be going for a pretty good discount based on what they were before i just want to see saquon because i did want to pick up saquon again and saquon is still a really high price okay 359 yeah they don't come out of pack so it's not exactly something that's going to come out with them but i do think a better running back than saquon could be coming out pretty soon so keep your eyes peeled although saquon they was looking pretty end game and now for the free agents as, for, as far as free agency goes, in my opinion, there's still more coming. This is just like the cream of the crop. Like, no, I think I said that wrong. This is just like the beginning of it. So I'd recommend you wait until some more stuff comes out because this is not everything. But this is really cheap. Like Chris Harris for 181. I know he's a little, he's a little slow, but Broncos team teams obviously would love him. Let's see what we got down here. Anthony Harris. Honestly, Anthony Harris, if the speed was a little better, he's looking pretty insane. If you could power him up and get him all the way, like his hip power, zone, man, speed combo, play rec combo with the site. Really, really solid. Just kind of sucks that you can't power him up. Had you been able to power him up, Anthony Harris would have been kind of beastly because you could have him to like a 95, 96 speed. And then obviously that's pretty much all of the ones that I was really concerned about here. Guys, that pretty much does wrap up the higher overalls. I'm not going to go check out the lower ones because this is kind of what we're working with at this point in the year for the most part. And you guys all know that. So Ultimate Legends today, great buy. Great, great, great buy because just with the, the pure amount of savings you could just make, off of just waiting till it drop and drop at 10 30 and then making your coins back by selling them later ton of profit there plus the 98 overalls i like them you might want to wait a little bit longer i would recommend use your power pass on them for the time being test them out see which quarterback you really want but if, my, if you have a lot of coins guys i think i'm gonna save my coins for the golden ticket quarterbacks i'm gonna buy ultimate legend players but i think i'm gonna spend my my quarterback personally i think you know, it's the best position on the field you gotta keep that one you gotta keep that you know as good as possible i think i'm gonna save that for a golden ticket quarterback i think that's only right but I gotta see the prices. It could be pretty insane. Maybe we gotta pull one. You know, it remains to be seen, guys. But that is better for the video. Team of the years, they moved a little bit. They're not gonna move a ton because again, they're not a card that's like much in the market these days. They're kind of just chilling and they are part of a lot of big power-ups, which is kind of what's gonna keep them in the game for as long as possible. But guys, that pretty much does wrap up today's video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to check out today's 10:30 video going over the ultimate legends. I do have an ultimate legend fantasy pack that I will be opening. Well, I did open in that video. So make sure you guys check that out. See if I pulled anything great. I had saved it for my ultimate legend, for my level up rewards actually, so I could open it just for that video. But guys, that's about it. Hopefully we pulled something great. Hopefully it went well. Make sure to check it out. Ultimate Legends Day. We're pretty, pretty good. One guy in particular I have been waiting for. Kind of upset about the way they made him, but been waiting for him. But guys, that's about it for the video. If you're into the channel, make sure to go to them below. Hit that subscribe button. Turn on the new bell, boys. 
enjoyed the family. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. Give this video a big thumbs up. Peace.